quick tip here for you. Um, right here, I've got a 700R4 tore down on the bench. Um, and uh, one thing that's been a common problem with these things, um, and of course it gets worse as the uh, wear and tear and mileage goes up on the unit, but it's the accumulator pistons. Now there's one in the case here. This is your fourth gear accumulator. And then you've got one that goes over top of it on the other side of the spacer plate kind of identical to it um, and that's your one two accumulator and they've got springs here that that uh, hold them up and you know of course changing the spring size changes the shift characteristics um, but they have a center pin in it now this one here is pressed into this housing but this one for the fourth accumulator piston uh, goes up in here and it goes into that center hole the problem with these things is in higher mileage units this pin will wear this bore out and it will allow fluid to leak past the pin to the other side of the piston um, and it's a good idea to replace these uh, you know if, if you have the plastic ones like they use in the 4L60Es because the plastic is is terrible uh, about cracking uh, especially if a unit's been overheated they get real brittle and then uh, you're back to square one uh, it's a common thing to go ahead and put these in in place of the plastic ones uh, because they're more durable um, but yet they wear the pin so I guess it's a trade-off but they are a better option over the plastic but anyways I'm going to show you what I'm talking about here this is a prime example of pin wear uh, in the piston so the pin and the both the piston and the pin will have to be replaced and I have found the same here in uh, the one two accumulator piston as well uh, it is also at fault um, as far as piston uh, pinhole wear so I'm going to put the camera down here and see if you can see this what I'm going to do I'm going to hold the piston with one hand and wiggle the pin and you can see on your right hand side how that pin is, w is wiggling in there so not only should it do like this but it should not do like this so you can see it'll do it the other way as well and it gets more extreme the more I pull it out towards the end it amplifies the effect so that is a good candidate for replacement. Um, otherwise, you're going to have shift problems, especially on a 700R4 where the whole thing is hydraulically controlled. Um.